The Assembly of First Nations prepares for its annual meeting. It begins tomorrow in Vancouver under a cloud of uncertainty. Following allegations of bullying and harassment, the organization's national chief has now been removed from the agenda for opening day. Nitu Garcha reports. Fix anything that needs to be fixed, it's a great opportunity. Ralph Leon is among hundreds of chiefs, elders, youth and representatives from across the country meeting in Vancouver for what is expected to be a heated week at the Assembly of First Nations Annual General Assembly. Nobody has that right to, to um, ban our national chief from her meeting. The AFN reversed an earlier statement that National Chief Roseanne Archibald would be barred from attending this week's meetings after Archibald made an urgent court appearance in Ontario last week to ensure she can legally attend. But the judge rejected her bid to overturn her suspension. I stand behind the National Chief and what she needs to do. Cookpee or Chief Judy Wilson says Archibald is dealing with issues that have compounded over years relating to the AFN's governance foundation, policies and procedures. There were issues that needed to be addressed then that we were told were addressed, but unfortunately they're not addressed because now they're escalated. Uh, to the forefront of this AGA. Wilson supports calls for a forensic audit spanning the last eight years after Archibald alleged she was being persecuted for trying to investigate corruption within the Assembly. I think as chiefs across Canada, we're just looking for the facts and the information. I don't want to buy into the drama of he said, she said. As they gathered for private meetings Monday, Archibald tweeted, the regional chiefs continue to try and silence me, my call for transparency, accountability and truth. They have erased the national chief from the agenda. This is a chiefs in assembly meeting, not an AFN exec meeting. Hashtag forensic audit now. If the national chief was forced out, in some through some uh, you know legal process, um, that will cause even more dissension and difficulty in the organization. So um, we will be watching the AFN meeting with more attention than we have in recent years. We can't lose focus on why we're here. Especially amid a pivotal point in Canadian history with a reconciliation focused papal visit to Canada just a few weeks away, many here say now is a critical time to bridge these divides. Neetu Garcha, Global News, Vancouver.